stuff that I'm like, oh, did I do that? Oh, I did. Packing up the camp. Some people aren't even even up, and we're about to roll in like five minutes. But allegedly, some people just can't keep a schedule. Everybody trying to regroup to get back together, head up, heading west out of St. Augustine. We we're actually going up the wrong way. Car up! On the rail bed, out of St. Augustine. Watch your bike. Folks right there. A little bit sketchy in the rain. Skeezy yeah. trying to ride it. Nice little bridge action here. Come on, Nick. Good. Here we are under the I-95 overpass, waiting on the other folks can make it up this rail. Carlos, Mike, Skeezy, Jeffrey. Waiting on everybody to regroup. I-95 underpass, third day, River to Sea Loop. If you can see somebody coming there in the pouring rain. Looks like it might be Nick. I think it is Nick. Come on, Nick! Here comes Jerry out of the rain, finally. The big tires handling the... Rock. Hitting, the, hitting the bike path off this rail. Still in the rain. Skeegee's excited. Yes. He wants to go back on the railroad track. Yeah. A little pace line action going on here. Hey, 
making our way to Wakulla Springs. River to Sea Loop, last day. Pace line in it, double, triple pace line almost. In the rain. I have one? Oh. Uh, let's see. How much battery I got? Where's that be? Here I am on Tram. Tram Road. It's turned off 100. Everybody else is taking a shortcut back. I'm on my way to Wakula Springs. Probably got another 60 more miles to go to make it to the end. Let's see how far it is to Wakula Springs. Continuing on to Wakula, all alone out here. I see some tire tracks, so there's people up ahead. Some people have broke off from the route and headed back. Shortcut. It's a beautiful road down here in the swamp. Here we go, passing over Dunn's Creek. Still heading to Wakula. Bridge. Still heading to Wakula, about to have to hop this fence. It says state park boundaries, so I don't see any tire tracks. Nobody else has come this way, so we'll see what happens. I'm assuming this is the Wakula State Park. I don't know. Apparently I'm in a state park, but I don't know which one. Just want to stop and check out these flowers. Of course, that's probably just a weed. Like Johnny jump ups that come up in my yard. Yay, sugar sand. Walking. Storm a brewing. Some wild turkeys up there. They done spotted me, dang it. Now they're taking off. Wild turkeys. Yeehaw. Go, boys, go. That was Dunn's Creek I just went through. Dunn's Creek Preservation Area. We got a Kangaroo Express convenience store stop coming up before the spring. So I'm looking for the kangaroo, baby. Get me some water and muscle milk. Making it to Wakila. Almost to the spring. 
little hiking trail that goes down to Wakula Springs. Almost there. Looking for a pavilion down here. I see some tire tracks, but I don't know if that's some of the loopers or not. Nice little trail. Still feeling strong. Got about 30 miles after the spring back to the car. We can do this. Here I am. Lone Looper made it to Wakula Springs. Thought there'd be people here, but this is really just a small little hidden place. Beautiful, clear, cold water feels good. Don't see any alligators or anything. I'm dipping. I'm about to take a dip. It's mandatory. Here's Sulphur Springs, which is just up from Wallaca Springs. And yes, it does smell like sulphur here. It kind of stinks. Sulphur Springs. Here we go. Cutting into the woods below Lake George. I see some tire tracks, so it looks like some other people have come through her other loopers came through anyway 25 more miles or so I'm ready to get there here I am in Seville and on some tacky dirt roads I'll tell you what sticky tacky but uh, heading on about 20 more miles to Single Track Samurai headquarters in Deleon Springs, but I think I'm just going to stay on road and get off route and take the direct route because I am tired. I don't know how far I've been today, but it feels like at least 80 miles. So anyway, onward. Here we go, about five miles from the finish. Riding road all the way back.